What type of community are we in? Does Dolly Parton live there? That's gotta be Dolly Parton's house. That's the biggest house in Myrtle Beach, easily, I would think. What do you think? out yard sailing in my neck of the woods and we ran into like a famous youtuber look we got common will picker with us i ran into a famous youtuber <laughs> yeah about? right i'll tell you what i wouldn't expect this is i don't see high-end houses high-end neighborhoods where i live like this good night yeah and honestly i didn't even know this was here so, and it must be it must be here for a long time but yeah. this is it's not huge it's only just a few roads i looked on the map back yeah there. it's not much to it i think it's a nice looking horse. That bag was in the thumbnail of this garage sale right there. Oh yeah, that's the coach one. How you doing? How you doing? How are you? How's it going? You're asking on your coach bag. You are, oh my gosh. No way. Yeah. Oh, that is so cool. Oh my gosh, no way. I am, oh my gosh, no way. Commonwealth flipper, but you're probably, I don't watch this channel. <laughs> you don't want, why don't you watch well, this one? <laughs> They're like the little Disney. Well, no, 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 maybe it's not. What maybe are you? Hang up. Vendor. Yeah, they do. Yeah, but look like that. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Coffee maker? What? I don't know what that is. It's a nice neutral water. Damaged. I don't know. I don't think I can ride it. Maybe I can. Good? Yep. All right. I did. Yeah, no. Actually, we need one. <laughs> it's your turf, so, you know, I won't, I'll, I'll stay away from those golf clubs. I hope he brings some out. We haven't found any in a while. What's in here? Good morning. You ain't gonna believe this. You like Packers? Uh, my wife loves the Packers. Well, Aaron Rodgers gave that to my wife. Really? Yeah. Gave this to your mother? My buddy, my bu one of my best oh, buddies. your buddy. Now I feel like I need to buy it. Now we feel like you do. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't sign it though. That's the problem. When well, you signed the jerseys that are on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know. I can imagine. Well, maybe I'll buy something for my wife then. How much you want for the towel? Oh, uh, yeah, that's my wife. I don't have any okay. idea. I'm just a grunt. You need some labor? Yep. Let's go. So. How much you have on your boots in there? What do you want Famous to do? Famous Green um, Bay towel. Uh, what are the boots? I think my daughter put a sticker on there. Cool. Yeah, $5. I, it don't matter to me. I can't prove they didn't give it to her. So that, <laughs> that don't make it worth much. I, do, I got a picture of him with her. That helps. Yeah, that, that's probably That don't help your wife, though. <laughs> this is a twin headboard. I don't know if y'all got kids. It's brand new. Hmm. That my daughter bought for her dorm in college and didn't want it. There's another desk. How much do you want for your... I have no idea. She'll be right back out. It's okay. Keith, so what do you want for those glass things? A uh, dollar a piece. Okay, thank you. Yeah, I need some TLC. Tires are flat. 
This one? Yeah. Right. For the, uh, Might the keep that in mind. Yeah. Yeah, that thing's cool. Thank cold. you. Yep, you got it. All right, I'm gonna get this and this. How much were you asking on your Kindle? Oh, I don't know. What, I don't know what's it worth. Oh, I have a couple bucks. Okay. And then I have this. Um, a dollar and five for that. That's one of those 31 baskets that oh, cool. cost an arm and a leg. Okay. <laughs> so five, six, eight, nine, ten. Yep, perfect. Okay. Do you have a 10? Because I've got a 10. Yeah, do. I have I've two fives. Perfect. That yeah, would be that's great. That's about it. <laughs> now, we do pretty good here. Guy over here got some tools. How's it going? Hey, boy. Come step, come on. I don't know. It's a little ornament. Uh, oh, hey, uh. Yeah, you How much is your head cover? Uh, two dollars. Two? Yep. I'll do both for two. Okay. Or four bucks. Isn't that bad looking? Right here is actually like a little bolo brand now. I didn't know it and I will definitely be looking out for it. Some of their shoes can go as high as $70 to $80 used. What is that thing? I don't know what that is. I don't think it's a... I don't think they're worth a whole bunch. How much you have on your hats? Five. Five? Yeah. Clean that one up a little bit. Don't fall. Go buckle. Ten dollars. Ten. And then this. Five. Right. So far we'll just get the uh You got a good deal on that. Look that up. I I think about forty fifty dollars. Really? <laughs> yeah, I looked it up. We'll do uh was it four bucks? Yeah. Alright, that'll work. All the pots for 15? Four or five. Each yourself for this. Three. Which one are you? I don't even know that. They're all brand new. These things are nice. Um, so the $15 would be? Everything. Every, like all that? Yep. I'll take all that for 15. That'll right. work. Let me go get your box. GPS truck tools. These trucker ones are actually worth a good bit. So are the RVs. Oh, that's not in there. I thought it was gonna be. Oh, the garment. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fan fast. Only way. Look at this old saw right here. What is that thing? That thing is neat. That's like an old jigsaw. You got working that. Yeah. Wow. I've never. I ain't never seen such a saw. It's it's pretty old, so it's an antique, but it works great. It's yeah. Just too heavy for me. Yeah. I mean, that thing's. Um. So twenty dollars for all of that. Five yes, bucks. For that. Yeah. I'll do twenty bucks Absolutely. for that. Seems pretty good. All right. I don't know how much this, uh, these are not Revere wear copper bottoms, but they are the made in the United States stainless. And they usually go, that, that boiler will probably go for 20 bucks on its own. So, and they're like in super good condition. She said they were brand new. 
it's one of the first times i think they are brand new and then this guy right here is a wind saw never heard of it before thought it was pretty cool oh kevin commonwealth pick over here doing some sort of deal got some pokemon stuff i don't know much about it <laughs> <laughs> You know what? You can't go wrong. <laughs> can't go wrong. That's right. And they have the box. Enjoy. He's it's knocking heavy. over it's the okay. pan. Did you it's get okay. them pots and pans? I did. I was going to show them to you, and I'm like, yeah. I, I didn't want to haul them, to be honest with you right now. The, the deal was too good to not get them. Oh, yeah? Yeah. How much did you get them for? Uh, everything for 15 bucks. Oh, well, see. And they were already in. It was like the neat. No. That is. That is. These things are nice. They, Yeah. Really good money. I was surprised. Yeah, some of them are worth like a like a ton ton. Is this Reba McIntyre? Yeah, it is. Look, it has all the stuff to go with it. Oh my shoes goodness. And the little country hat. That's funny. Cool? Yeah. Babe, look. Reba. <laughs> That's hilarious. I think I am going to okay check out yeah. here. Um, I got yeah. a lot of stuff here. Okay. <laughs> How much do I have up so far? Okay, 25, 30, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. How much are, I'm sorry, yeah, I, I just don't, yeah, I'm not I, sure I know. how much they're, they're like me. And I can get the price <laughs> everything, I'm sorry. No, 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 you're fine. How much is the um, the per purse inside of here? I think it does it have a price. That's a Harley one. It's ten. Ten. Yeah, okay. it's a it's so a ten. And then how much was I this? I think I have fifteen on this one. 
Yeah. Oh, okay. You okay. have them more. Okay, yeah. so 10, okay. 15. Okay. That's, that's okay. 25, right? 25. Yeah, 25. Okay. 25. What do you I'm think? I'm going to leave this Okay. One. Yeah. 7, 40. Okay. 40. 43. Okay. This is the cool engine. V, but. It's usually always something. Just too much. Five bucks on that, but it's Jeez. super stained up. If it was it's not even that. Look. Yeah, it's got a big. I didn't look at the uh, clothes. Maybe. Is this a Scotty Cameron? Be a Scotty Cameron. <laughs> no. <laughs> There's a Tony Hawk. This isn't a good one. I one time found a Tony Hawk, like an older one. Yeah. And uh, I think it sold for like 700 bucks. 700? Yeah, it was one of his like originals. Got it in a store, you know. How many stores do you, I've seen you buy a few. How many have you done? Um, I think really only like five or six. How much you asking on your grass catcher? Huh? How much you asking on your grass catcher? Follow. Season to sell them. They usually go for 30 to 40 bucks. Hmm. Especially probably the Troy built. Yeah. yeah. I even, might pick it up. Even if they're un, no, if they're un, like branded like these, are they still worth the? No. Just the ones that are branded. And really, they're hard to determine. Most of them are pretty standard, but sometimes the tags on. I thought there was a tag there. Yeah. They got these numbers, and sometimes you can find them by those, but I don't know if they're. So that's just a tag warning. Sure. There's different models. I've never had a return on one though, so you can take them off of there and just sell the bag. People need replacement bags. Oh, that makes sense. And Probably easier to ship too. You make a little too. bit less money, but it's so much easier to ship. So yeah. That ain't too bad. Yeah. Thanks, buddy. Okay. Yeah, they're actually not in bad shape. They are size uh, ten and a half. I mean, those got a lot of life left in them. They're silver. I ain't never seen the ones that were. They are fancy, yeah, like chrome. They always dry rot right around the. These are actually pretty good. I bet she's asking 10 bucks. How much you got on your shoes? Uh, that's five dollars. Five? Alright, I'll give them five. Right <laughs> that's the right price. Little thermos. Batman. I think the Reba thing is so funny. Super cool. Is that a, um... I don't, I don't know. It's like a... It's that type of doll, and, oh, oh, yeah. and then it's and then it comes with all her clothes. Really? Yeah. How much is your Reba? Um, uh, I was doing maybe 12, 12? Mm -hmm. and it has a little hat, and has a little shoe. There should be another shoe in here. I hope it's should be. It has dresses. One. They're all stuck together. Oh, here's the other shoe. And his little gloves and little. Look how cute. <laughs> Little pants. Yeah, I got time. Back from the yard sales.
Let's go over some stuff that Kayla picked up. She definitely had the winner winner chicken dinner yard sale. Uh, there was just a ton of cool designer and name brand stuff when it comes to these bags. $43 for all of them. One will actually double that. The rest will be pure profit. Michael Kors in the back here. It's like a des she's, uh, Kayla said it's an older style but still desirable. Just has to be cleaned up a little bit and that'll be good to go. Kate Spade lunchbox right here. It says out the lunch on it. It is Kate Spade right there and uh this might actually be sold on our whatnot show if you didn't know we are on whatnot there's a link down below steve madden purse right there or wristlet or small purse i don't really know and uh this one right here though i didn't know the brand name on this this is called brighton and it is a designer type of purse super super nice the red one that has the same like faux crocodile look to it went for like a hundred and some bucks or two hundred dollars. This one right here, we're thinking we'll probably get like fifty bucks for. And it is a Brighton purse again. Uh, we've actually sold Brighton shoes before. Some of them can go over a hundred dollars. Most of them go for like twenty. And some of the purses aren't quite as desirable as this one. So I yeah, we think about fifty bucks on that. Any type of Harley Davidson, like true Harley Davidson, and the tag is in there right there. Made in the United States, Harley Davidson little book bag. These are very, 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 very desirable. This will sell probably instantaneously for 50 bucks. We'll probably clean it up and probably try to get like 70 bucks for it. Some are listed well over $100. This is a coach, like slim satchel for a guy or a laptop bag it is super cool it is coach that has a little tag on the inside it is authentic we did look it up all the numbers check out correctly and brand new 250 bucks on the used market probably about a hundred dollars and this one right here is like a little crossbody leather bag uh, kayla likes the crossbody stuff that's how we actually put our cameras on us when we're out there is on a crossbody like this so that is super cool she picked again all of that up and this little thing back here which is like a daisy super juicer there you go, Daisy Super Juicer. And all that was 43 bucks, so probably, ah oh man, it's five times your money on that. Can't go wrong with that. So sitting next to all of these bags are these bags. We just got our new shipment in from Gyro Pack. Gyro Pack is an affiliate link, link down below. They have honestly like the cheapest poly bags and poly mailers, bubble mailers that we can find. If you use my code, it's even cheaper. You get 10% off. They have different colors. We got all different colors here so we can show y'all. They have more colors than this. So definitely be on the lookout for these things right here. Sometimes they sell out kind of fast because they do have cheap prices. It's really good quality. Like this stuff right here has a good stick to it. So it's not like it's gonna anything's gonna fall out of them. Again, this is an affiliate link. So we get a little bit of each uh, sale that you put on their website. We get a little bit of, of that, but definitely a good, good brand to take a look at. Again, link is down below. Use the code Bearded Thrift Machine to get 10% off your purchase. So a very cool day out there, yard sale. And as you saw, we had Kevin, the Commonwealth Picker down here with us. He messaged me and said, hey, I'm actually had to come into town real quick, Myrtle Beach. A lot of people come into Myrtle Beach for like uh, sporting events and stuff like that that their kids are in because we have big facilities around here, you know, the convention center. It's kind of like a mecca of stuff. So it's actually pretty cool. A lot of people coming into town. If you're in town and I have, you know, if you want to shoot me a message and I might have the time to come see you. Actually, he was like, where are you gonna be on Saturday? And I told him exactly where I'd be, exactly what time. And we got to, you know, pick with Commonwealth Picker. So it's always fun to pick with other people because we pick up different things and then you get to learn. Like, I didn't know that grass catchers go for like 45 to 90 dollars online. Now that will be one thing that I'm on the lookout for. So I do appreciate everybody watching. Remember, if you're not subscribed, subscribe, comment down below, like the video, and you know I will always get you on the next one.